There are mysteries all around us, and we are fascinated by what we cannot understand. Inexplicable phenomena are discovered every day, keeping our curiosity piqued and the prospect of knowing the world around us a foreign concept. It is possible to find something new and exciting, big or small, in the most extreme places on Earth. Some take us to different planets and tell us about the cosmos. Some tell us about our history and where we came from. All of them leave us eager to learn more. So today, here at Unexplained Mysteries, we'll be exploring three new discoveries dating back to the start of our universe, mistakenly found black holes, and the secret potential of quantum mechanics. A giant galaxy seen lighting up the universe shortly after the Big Bang. Did you know that right after the Big Bang, the universe was actually characterized by a period of complete darkness? Scientists refer to this time as the Cosmic Dark Ages, and essentially, a dense gas filled the universe, blocking all visible light and making observation impossible. Gradually, over the next 200 million years, planets began forming and emerging and with them they radiated ionized plasma which penetrated the existing gas, clearing the universe of its darkness. The details surrounding how this reionization of our universe actually occurred are still unclear to astronomers though, and as much research has gone into tracking the earliest known planets and their formations in the hope that this would shed light on the end of the cosmic dark ages. In 2020, a team from UCL discovered a luminous galaxy that they believed contributed to the alleviation of darkness a staggering 13 billion years ago. Venturing further back in time and back into the history of our universe is a fascinating mystery which is yet to be solved, making this ancient find crucial to ongoing research in this field. With the discovery formally presented at the annual European Astronomical Society meeting, they elaborated to explain that this is the first solid proof of a galaxy reionizing a bubble of gas on its own. Up until now, relatively little is known for sure about the origins of the universe and its early evolutionary journey. Current models suggest that the very first galaxies were formed by coalescing star clusters and that those stars came from the universe's formation. Over time, those first galaxies then emitted the radiation which we know helped to dissipate the dense obstructive gas smothering the universe. Astronomers explain the ongoing mystery being that they have genuine evidence that the cosmic dark ages existed, and clearly, when we can see that the universe is now cleared of it. However, they still struggle to explain how and why beyond this. Hence, the discovery of a visible galaxy from 13 billion years ago is exciting evidence pointing them in the right direction. ARKIT to start sending quantum keys with satellites You may have heard about the anticipated wonders that quantum technologies could do for us in the near future. UK startup ARKIT are looking to make these ideas into reality, with their ambitious plans to start delivering quantum encryptions all over the world via satellites in a mere two years. Quantum encryption keys are thought to be unbreakable, at least with current computing powers, and use quantum properties of subatomic particles, such as photons, the smallest light particles. Basic quantum theories, such as wave particle duality, explain on the simplest level of this technology how such an encryption could possibly be unbreakable. Similar to the Schrodinger's cat thought experiment, the idea is that in the quantum realm, particles behave like waves, and waves like particles thus exhibiting a dual-state behavior. With encrypted data, this means that transmissions can be carrying all possible keys of information at once, but once you observe it prematurely, the photons drop their multi-state, choosing one observable state. This means that by observing it, you have destroyed the information, collapsing the photon's superposition early. As such, unless you can hack the data to observe it, without detection, currently impossible, Quantum encryption is, in this way, unbreakable. With ARKIT partnering with giants such as BT in the UK and Northrop Grumman in the US, their plans to launch two quantum key distribution satellites in 2023 will be absolutely game-changing if they pull it off. They also explain that while fiber optics can transmit some amount of quantum data, 
This is extremely limited and slow, and thus the only plausible way to deploy quantum key distribution, especially on a global scale, is by using satellites. This is because space is a vacuum, and as such information-loaded photons can travel literally hundreds of miles much more easily and much faster than through friction-loaded fiber-optic cables. This said, ARKIT is already providing quantum key distribution solutions through fiber optics but with special software additions too. Their 2022 satellite plans are thus only the next step in what looks to be a long and promising future ahead of the futuristic startup. Discovery of a Dying Supermassive Black Hole by Accident You may know this already, but black holes are difficult to observe directly, as they can often be fairly inactive and, in turn, invisible. However, everyone's favourite fact, when black holes catch material drifting into their reach, they are able to pull and stretch more light from the universe than any other galactic phenomenon we know of. The cores of these black holes are referred to as active galactic nuclei, or AGNs, and are also what scientists consider to be the strongest proof that supermassive black holes exist. They are considered supermassive because their masses range from 1 million up to an insane 10 billion solar masses, and with the aforementioned issues with normal observations, AGN detections are often a great indicator of a supermassive black hole. For all these reasons, when a team from Tokyo discovered an AGN nearing the end of its lifespan, it was a huge discovery, made all the more special by the fact that it was an accident. They stumbled across the new AGN while monitoring another signal from a nearby galaxy, and believe that this new AGN has been obstructed from view for at least 3,000 years. Going into more detail, they explained that they discovered a jet lobe when using the Atacama Large Millimeter Submillimeter Array combined with the Very Large Array, but found that the jet lobe had no signal from its nucleus. This, therefore, suggests that they found a silent AGN. By using non-detection, the Tokyo astronomers explained that they were lucky to have found the dead nucleus. This discovery may have been an accident. They have announced that they plan to continue investigating the end of AGNs using similar methods to the one that led to this find. They also added that they wish to monitor gas inflows and outflows as follow-up research, as this can help confirm the behaviors of ending AGNs. For example, it is known that after the end of an AGN, smaller tells of their existence become fainter and less observable as photons, their light source, begins to shut down. This said, the larger surrounding ionized gas region is still visible and able to be detected, owing largely to how long it takes for light from photons to travel. While, therefore, some amount of the evolution of AGNs is known through their lifetime, this new discovery has shown that there is so much more to learn, and it will be exciting to see what other supermassive black holes are out there waiting for us to find them, intentionally or not. But what do you make of these recent discoveries? Be sure to let us know your thoughts in the comments section below and help us by growing this community while working to solve these unexplained mysteries. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.